Hi friends! Welcome to my channel. This is Amanda. Hope you're doing extremely well today and are having a fantabulous day. I am in a terrible mood, so I decided to walk downstairs and do some crafting to see if I could lift myself out of this mood and hopefully <laughs> you can uh, help me with that. All right. Now, I apologize. We are going to use this um, Penguin DSP. It's a celebration item. If you don't have it, uh, you can't get it. But for those of you that still do have it, I haven't made a card with this yet with you guys. And well, I was in a crummy mood. So I decided, you know what? This is such a fun paper uh, that we're going to bring it out. Uh, and we're going to use this. We're also going to use the Penguin Place Bundle, which is this cute little set. And of course, the punch. All right, we're going to do a fun fold today. I know, shocker, me and fun folds, we normally don't get along, but I'd like to try something fun today. And I think I'm gonna actually try to do some fun folds and give you the measurements um, in five by seven. Because the truth is, you know, five by sevens are five by sevens and I don't do smaller ones. So I'd like to convert those fun folds for you guys into, um, five by seven sizes and then you will have those in your arsenal so i'm going to do that starting next year but of course we're going to start one this year we're going to take a piece of fresh freesia and we're going to cut it at seven inches we'll have to take out our arm for this and we'll just cut that easy peasy this could get put in your scraps okay very good all right, now we are going to score this at two and a half. Four. Seven. And eight and a half. too hard. Very good. All right. Now, this is going to be the pop-up center. All right. These are going to be the two little arms. Easy peasy, right? And in a five by seven. So, I mean, one of the easier fun folds. And you know, I like that it's five by seven and easy to remember score lines. And I'm just going to give this a good, is it varnish, 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 burnish? I'm going to get a very good crease with my yucky bone folder. I don't know why I keep using it when my good one is right where it should be. All right. Now this will fit in a regular five by seven envelope. So no problems there. All right. All right, excellent. Now it will scooch out a little bit. All right, and it sits up really nice. Okay, all right, let's put that to the side. Now, all right, now this piece right here, let's cover with some DSP. This piece, let's cover with some DSP. And this one, we're gonna make pretty. So we might do some DSP, I don't know. Let's let's play around together. All right, let's get one of those really cute scenes from our DSP. This is a cute one. That one might work. Oh, but this one's cute too. That one might work. All right, we got the blue. And then for, ooh, that could be the middle, because I like that. All right, let's check this out. Or this could be the middle. Hmm. All right, let's do one of these two as the sides. And why don't we do this? Why don't we see which one looks better? on the fresh freesia. Oh, well, that didn't work. They both look really good on the fresh freesia. He's making a little snowman here, which is just adorable. Or they're skiing. And since I like neither one of those activities because it's 
cold and I don't like the snow. I love to look from the inside with the fire burning snow, but I don't like anything else. All right, so I think we're gonna use this sheet all together. So we're gonna use the back and the front. All right, so we are going to go two and three eighths and cut that. We will cut this by six and seven eighths. There we go. Ooh, I think we should do it this way. No, maybe this way? This way? Let's check. And then this one again is the same size. Two and seven eighths. No, two and three eighths. I apologize. Two and three eighths by six and seven eighths. And this time we'll leave some of that up there. By six and seven eighths. I will do some the measurements on the screen for you so it's easy. Now, this. So we should do it like that, right? So it's a continuous little scene. Not that anyone will actually know, but there we go. All right, now let's turn it over and use this side. And we should probably do this one. We're going to go um, two and seven eighths by six and seven eighths. Scooch this up here. And then we'll cut this at the 7 8 mark, which is going to be very fun trying to do this. <laughs> we'll cut it at a little bit above and then we will fix it. Because I did not leave enough. All right, let's. Trim this off. Whoa! Crazy Amanda here. All right, and we'll cut the top off at six and seven eighths. Oh, I did pretty good. Just a little bit. And that will be our middle. All right, let's attach these. I think we're done with this, but I'm not sure, so I'll leave this close by. We will use our stamp and seal and put some adhesive on this. Now this stamp and seal is really great, so I don't need I don't use very much of it. Just one or two little ticks here and there. Always on the edges, of course. This is again a tight fit. Excellent. And then this one. I love this paper and I was so bummed when I forgot to use it before celebration ended. I was, you know, in, in Phoenix and I was like, oh no, but hopefully you guys have some left or I have a surprise for you. I, not really a surprise, but you know, not a woohoo surprise, but I did make some other ones that maybe you can um, copy if you like this set in the whimsical and wonder whimsy and wonder set all right now let's put this in the middle again just a little bit of um stamp and seal plus here it's much easier if you don't like the stamp and seal because it's you know already um cut in such a, such a way that uh you don't always have to keep doing this but sometimes I do. I'm, I do like the stamp and seal. Um, as long as you go up like that afterwards, you'll have, you know, as long as you go with your wrist up, you'll always have it where it belongs. But some people, I know my upline Lori really likes the stamp and seal plus over the stamp and seal. All right, we'll get that right in the middle here. There we go. Pretty, right? Because this paper is so cute. Just so stinking cute. All right, now let's jazz up this middle part. And for that, we're going to take our punch. And I can't believe I just did that. I'm sorry. I hope the noise wasn't too bad. We will cut out our little penguin. Oof! 
I got a boo-boo on my finger because I was playing around and um, wiped some paper on the edge and then I got a really bad paper cut. I mean, it's really bad. I even put some antiseptic on it because it was so bad, so. Yeah, that one's not really perfect. Let's do one more. There we go, that's better. Oh, there we go, there we go. Well, I guess they're all the same. Silly. All right, let's do him. We'll take out our little set. Ooh, maybe we should cut out the reindeers for this one. That would be super cute. Yeah, let's do that, all right. Um, uh, we could make a little scene, you know what I mean? And maybe, maybe we should. Maybe we should make a little scene. What do you think? Sorry, I'm off. And then have this be the snow in the background? All right. You guys convinced me. Let's do that. All right, great news. There's actually two that we could use. Well, there's many in the, um, in the mini catalog. Uh, but for the annual catalog, the ones that I have, I have the Inspired Thoughts that we could use. And it has a nice hill, so that's great. Or even this border dies. Now, the reason that I'm not going to use the border dies today is because it's stitched. And I don't have anything other else stitched um, on my paper. But I really like the stitched part of it. I'm going to have to do something um, about making my cards stitched because I really like those as well. All right, so let's grab some scrap white. And I just have to grab it. There we go. And for this, I'm actually going to do two, I think. So let's cut this, um, what did I say, two and seven eighths? Yes, there we go. And I think we're gonna cut this twice. So there's two little, right here maybe, and then um, we'll cut it twice. And then we will put a sediment on the bottom. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Now, let's check to see. I really like this Have a Holly Jolly Christmas or Jingle All the Way. Hmm. Can you guys hear Christmas music in your background? We'll do Have a Holly Jolly Christmas, but I really like this Jingle All the Way and I haven't used it yet. Can I, can I just, you know, use it this time? Yes, yes, we'll do Jingle All the Way. Let me take a quick second and put this Jingle All The Way um, label on. And I don't know if you guys have ever done this before. Maybe you have. So I tore off um, the top sheet. There's a little split in there so you know which side to tear off. And I took off this backing right here. Okay, let me just throw this away so it's not in here anymore. And then um, I'm going to take it and I'm going to line it up with only the tip or the side. All right. And then I'm going to walk my fingers over it, pressing down gently and folding it down, not folding, but you know what I mean? Rolling it down so it's there all the way and then I can pop it off and it's a great fit. All right. So I really like this jingle all the way. Should we do fun and do lots of colors? Do you guys mind if we speak, spend some time and do that on our Samparatus? All right, let me grab that. I was playing with this um, set. So let me, let's do that. And then we'll bring this up here. Right here. Jingle all the way right here. And let's get this straight. All right. And since jingle all the way is definitely not straight, let's just put it semi straight. Let's just try that again. I'm gonna take this up so I can see it. Straight and the lines are terrific for this. Now let's grab out our stamp and write markers because that's how I like to do it. And the colors here that I think that we should use are balmy blue, balmy blue, 
and Fresh Freesia, of course. I think this is Misty Moonlight. Is that it? Oh, the soft sea foam. I'm really wondering if that color will come out for us. And then what green is this? Is this garden green? Nope, just jade. Just jade. Where are you, just jade? Scoot you around. Just jade. Excellent. All right. We will use our brush tip. And I'm not going to necessarily do these in order. I'm just going to do a few of them. So they're random. There we go. I'm going to speed this up so I won't talk because when I, before I had kids, I could do like multiple things at a time. And then I had children and then I can only do one now. So allow me to brush this up. I'm going to speed this up really quickly and then I'll be right back. All right, guess like, guess we didn't need the soft sea foam. I only got one, <laughs> one fresh freesia in there, but that's okay. That's all right, it works well. Okay, let's put this to the side and we'll get our little stamp and write machine out. Stamp and write. Stamp and emboss machine. And let's get some plates. All right, we got this. Uh-oh, friends. I don't think I put my stuff away from last time I was playing with it. All right. I'll have to go search for it. Oh, I'm so bad. There's one part. <laughs> All right. I'll be right back. So you guys don't have to be, have, you guys don't have to watch me searching all over my really messy desk for this. <laughs> Great news, I didn't have to clean up my um, entire craft room to find it. <laughs> this isn't gonna work. This isn't gonna work. We're gonna need our big um, embossing machine. <laughs> oh no, I am losing my mind. All right, I do have that right by because I was playing with that just a second ago. Let's pull this off. All right, here we go. We are gonna need it because this is not gonna fit any way other than, here we go, like that. And we can put this wherever we want. There we go. Can you guys see that? All right, good, you can. And then I'll put this on top. Push this through, easy peasy. You guys know the sandwich already, so that's good. <laughs> All right, it moved. <laughs> Let's cut it, and then we'll be done. All right, here we go. We'll have to do the jingle all the way correctly this time. All right. Oh, my heavens. Well, at least my mood's gotten better. Because if not, wow, that would be in a really bad mood. Oh, I know why. Look, this can't go off the edge. There we go. Silly Amanda. Tricks are for kids. Wow. All right. And then we will have to do the top again. This will be the top. Let's do the um, bottom. Oh, no, this works perfectly. All right. We'll do it that way. No, we can't. All right. We're going to move this down so it doesn't look exactly the same. There we go. No, 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 no. Come on. There. Perfect. Now let's scoot you over a little bit. I don't want you to be. There we go. All right. One more time. And then guess what? We get to do the sediment completely over. 
but I will uh, speed that along again. <laughs> All right. Okay, here we go. Now we can make this. Yeah, perfect. And we'll be like this. Here we go. Let's cut this off so we don't see it. And, hmm, guess what? We already have the jingle all the way set up in the um, apparatus. Isn't that shocking and great? <laughs> all right, let's put this here. All right, now this time I want to use more fresh freesia. All right, you know what? Let's clean it off. Let's grab a baby wipe. I really need to start using my um, little cloth, but I don't have access to water down here that easily. I have to actually get my tush up. So you know how that is. All right, let's do this. This time we are going to do some more purple because I like the fresh freesia. So we're only going to do two letters this time. All right, two letters. Perfect. Now, this blue is uh, hard for me because it is um, uh, it is dry, but that's okay. I'll just have to work it a few times. Oh, it looks pretty good today. I can always refill this one. All right, I'm sorry. It's not perfect. All right. Now let's do... Oh, that's cute. I'm glad we used the soft sea foam this time. Get off little hair. Bolty is definitely around today. Snoozing behind me. What do we have left? Actually, I like this one better. See, that was all intentional, so I could do it again. All right. And then we'll do all with different colors too. Easy peasy. I really like making my letters different colors. Oops, this H does not look perfect, friends. Let's fix that. Using the Stamparatus is the best way to do this. Now, all A with some fresh freesia. Twice to be nice. Excellent. And then I really like how the Misty Moonlight looks. All right. Three. Three is good. And then, ooh, I really kind of like the um, soft sea foam. Sorry, friends, that was children again. What can you say? All right, hopefully we won't need this again. Now, let's get our brush and some of this balmy blue. And we'll just do the top. Just the top here. There we 
There we go. That's what I wanted. All right. And again, we'll do the top of this one. Balmy blue is a perfect color, or pool party would work, but since we're using balmy blue, this will look great. What do we think? Yes, excellent, I love it. All right, wipe this off a little bit. Put you away so the next time I can find you. And let's start building the scene. You can always do like this, but Let's get you flat so it's easier to play with. Here we go. Oh, no. No, 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 no. No, this needs to come down. All right, this needs to go on flat. We're just going to try one more time like this. Oh, this takes up a nice, nice amount, nice amount. Okay, it's almost half the card. All right, and then let's grab some dimensionals. Why do I always grab the baby ones? All right, got some mamas. I got this um, package wet, and so now my dimensionals don't want to come off very nicely, so... I have to fiddle with them. Guess I shouldn't have laid something on them, huh? There we go. And I'm going to put several on these because, well, I just, I like to keep my things popped up to go through the mail. Hope that makes sense to everyone. We will need our babies. Excellent. All right, this is stinking cute. I'm really glad we decided to make this like this, guys. Very good. Okay, now let's grab our little guy. And let me get a little... baby block. And that way I don't get everything all over. All right. Little eyes, cute, and some memento, which I still have not um, inked up. So I'm going to go on the corners. Hopefully that'll be darker. All right, I'm going to try to do this in the center so he's not looking away. He's looking at you. All right, well, it is what it is. I should remember to ink it up, huh? All right. Oh, we need orange. I forgot. We need his little beak. Here we go. Perfect. All right. Well, I didn't like that one anyways. Let's punch this out again. Thank goodness there's more around here. All right. Ink this up one more time. Not press too hard this time. Even pressure. <gasps> Much better. Oh, he's looking away a little bit, but that's okay. Now let's grab our little beak. There we go. And some pumpkin pie. Just a blue. Pumpkin pie. Grab his cute little beak. He's definitely smiling, don't you think? He's in a much better mood than I am. Although, I'm telling you, that was a laugh. All right, let me see if I can not put anything on this one. Should he go way down here? 
I don't know. We'll see. All right, baby dimensionals we need for his little feetsies. And let's get the cutest side. All right. Wow. This is a card feat when everything has gone wrong. I almost dropped that. It's been, like I'm telling you guys, it's been quite a day. Actually, I'm not in a bad mood for today. I'm just in a bad mood in general. I woke up on the wrong side of the bed this morning. Well, yesterday I woke up on the wrong side of the bed too. So you know what? It must not be the bed. Just saying. This little foot is not perfect. I'll use this one instead. Here we go. He's a cutie patootie. All right, let's put some dimensionals on him. All right, I'm gonna check really quickly if we can do the antlers and it looks normal. Because I'm not very good at fussy cutting. So. There we go. Oh, that's, that's adorable. All right, let's put some of this away before we forget. Should we put a little tree back here? Maybe. All right. All right, that's as good as it's getting right now. get these. No, I forgot I wanted to do this. All right, not bad. Put you down there. And I left a little bit right here so that I could put it where I wanted it. little headband now. There we go. All right. He is a cutie patootie. What do you think? All right. So we'll stand him on like that. He goes perfectly in a five by seven envelope. This one's a dud. All right, all right, all right. Let's put this away too so we don't forget it. All right, put this out of the way. I think he is just adorable. All right, let's look at the other ones that I made. This one is my least favorite, so. Well, this one is my favorite, I guess. This is my least favorite, maybe. Mary Everything, using the Whimsy and Wonder. DSP. That's some glue back there. Pretty paper, right? Easy peasy. This would be easy to mass produce. I guess the reason that I don't like it as much as this one is because it's so cute. And this one's just a little bit, you know, more easy and simple. All right, in this one, I used the Whimsy and Wonder set. And this is, I think, from the Painted Christmas. And I like that one as well. This, I just um, cut this out with the dye and used Mossy Meadow brush and then a blending brush and then put the um, pieces back and I used some washi tape behind there so it would stay. So, all right, what do you think? You love them? Do you hate them? Love it if you would um, give a thumbs up and hit subscribe and uh, leave a comment below. All right, friends, I had a great time and you lifted my mood and I really appreciate it. So also, if uh, you would like a Christmas card for me, I would love it if you put your name and number in an email and shoot it off to me. I have lots of Christmas cards that I don't know what I'm gonna do with, so I'd love to send you one. Um, my email address will be on the screen and uh, just shoot me an email. All right, friends, you have a very wonderful weekend, and I'll see you next time. Thanks, friends. Bye-bye.